It's like having two toddlers that are constantly getting into things. Constantly, you guys. Hi everybody, it's Emmy Bree and welcome back to my channel. If you guys are new, hit that subscribe button down below. So today, I am going to be doing a cat video. This is gonna go horribly wrong. I'm gonna get covered in scratches. <laughs> so today, I am going to be answering all of your cat questions about my fur babies. Um, people are constantly DMing me and constantly asking me questions and also roasting my cats. So I just wanted to clarify some things and also give you a little information about them. So I have two cats. I have Priscilla and Mr. Pickles and they are actually siblings. They share the same father and Priscilla is older. She is about a year and a half years old and Pickles is around seven to eight months. Um, and so we got Priscilla first and then we slowly introduced Mr. Pickles and he was a teeny, teeny, teeny little thing and Priscilla was basically full grown when we brought um, Pickles into the house. Um, and I have a whole video slash vlog about bringing Mr. Pickles home and you guys can kind of check that out if you want. I'll put that link in the description below so you guys can just click on that if you want to see Mr. Pickles as a baby more. <laughs> so I am just going to check my DMs really quick and see if you guys have any good questions for me. So a lot of people seem to be concerned with their size. Um, Persian cats tend to be on the larger size and they're really not that big. It's like 75% fluff because um, when we took out, insert a video, when we got Priscilla shaved, she was so teeny and like just a skinny little thing, um, which was hilarious. <laughs> um, so they're not overweight, they're perfectly fine. We feed them. Um, typically we just have food out, but we will refill the bowl twice daily. And they're pretty good about sharing. We have a bowl that has a dual um, sort of bowl and then uh we just fill it up and they kind of take as they please so together i think they probably weigh a solid 20 pounds i've got lots of kitties all right you guys so i would like to introduce you to priscilla and that's with two r's like per i know i'm very punny um and she is about a year and six months i'd like to say and she is a himalayan persian and she um, doesn't want to be held right now. I'm gonna let her go and give her a treat. So somebody wants to know what um, Pickles and Priscilla's favorite snacks are and I actually have them here. And if you guys can tell that they love them, look what they have done to the packaging. They have completely ripped it open. I swear they like work together. So their favorite flavor is this one and it is just the ocean flavor one. <laughs> um, so they really, really love these. We got um, them in every single flavor and they have like really taken a liking to these three specifically, but specifically the ocean flavor, which makes their breath smell amazing. Oh, we got a special guest. So this is, oh, 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 oh be nice. Oh, God. <laughs> All right, you guys, so this is Mr. Pickles. And yes, he got his name from the really demented murderous dog show. And, and he's a good boy, so that's kind of how he got his name. <laughs> Goodbye, Mr. Pickles. So a lot of you guys wanted to know kind of their personalities. Obviously, if you guys follow me on Snapchat and you guys can follow um, Priscilla and Mr. Pickles' Instagram, you guys can kind of tell their personalities. Um, Mr. Pickles is just hilarious. He's just really like energetic and funny, um, but he's also the cuddle bug of the two. He sleeps above my head every single night. Um, and he like needs attention in the morning. Like I'll sit on my bed with my phone like this and he'll just repeatedly like knock his face like into my phone and my hands like wanting cuddles. Um, and then Priscilla is just a sweetheart. She's the friendlier of the two. Um, she'll run up to anybody who answers the door or like whatnot. Um, she's the life of the party. Anytime we have people over, she's like, she like seats herself right in the crowd of people and just like likes to get pet. It's so funny. Um, and she kind of loves to cuddle too, but it's very much so on her own terms. So if you try to get her to cuddle and she doesn't want to cuddle, like you are not cuddling with her. Like, end of story. <laughs> 
So for anybody who knows me very well, I make up the weirdest nicknames ever and I will go through that right now. So let's roll that footage. <laughs> I warn you, it's weird. I don't know where all these nicknames came from, but just bear with me here. Side of Guac, Siggy, Siglandia, Siglord, my Sagwa, and everything kind of originated from Sagwa, which is a cartoon show. So, Side of Guac, my Siglord, they all kind of stemmed from Sagwa because she kind of looks like the main character from that show. <laughs> like hair everywhere. I love wearing black and whew, I go through many lint rollers folks. So Mr. Pickles also has nicknames like Pickled Egg or Picks and yeah but mostly just Mr. Pickles. Why are you being torched for me today? So hopefully you guys got to know my two fur babies just a little bit better. Um, they're really just amazing little guys and make sure to follow my Snapchat to get constant funny videos of them doing. Um, I also got a sneak peek of their Halloween costumes on uh, Snapchat so make sure you're following me there. Um, if you guys liked this video give it a thumbs up and subscribe down low and please leave any comments for future videos. Um, also leave a comment down below if you guys have a cat and I'd love to know what your cat's name is. So I really hope that I answered all of your guys' questions. Thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you guys next time.